hi guys and uh, welcome back so I'm continuing with this uh, series whereby I'll be showing you trade examples in relation to the candlestick patterns that we have discussed in this course so today I'm going to be showing you a trade example of a bearish engulfing pattern a real-life trade example so Today we've got the USDJPY Japanese yen against the dollar. So we've got uh, an example of a bearish engulfing trade example. So looking at uh, the yen chart, I came to a decision to say I'll be hunting for short trades on lower time frames. Reason being that we had. Uh, price action rallying into an area of strong supply and again I emphasize if you haven't taken my supply and demand course uh, most of the concepts that I use they are well explained in that uh, supply and demand course you can sign up or enroll to that course to understand better because only here I'll be highlighting in the trade according to the pattern that I would have seen so Seeing that uh, USDJPY has been heading into a strong area of supply, I was hunting for short trades on lower time frames such as 15 minutes, 30 minutes or 1 hour chart. Thereby, I would have to switch back to my uh, bearish types of candlesticks. In this case, uh, I was hunting for bearish engulfing pattern. So, just to summarize a bit, uh, the bearish engulfing pattern is a major reversal signal with two opposite color big bodied candles comprising this pattern. The close of the bearish candle must be beyond 65% 10. So now, once I've seen that uh, the last up candle tested a strong area of supply, which came in here, a strong area of supply we've got a supply zone here which was tested with yesterday's price action you see so now meaning with this candle here in this candle that's where i was hunting for short trades and you're gonna see once i dip down to uh lower time frame so now let's go to a. Uh, this is a daily chart so i'm gonna go first to a h4 chart so that you can clearly see you can see where my entry is my entry point is right here where the arrow is. Let me just show you quickly. My entry point is in this price action candle, right? That's where we started seeing some rejections. So now I'm going to go into that candle's price action on lower time frame. I'm going to go straight to an hourly chart. So now you can clearly see where my entry point is it was after a huge rejection so this is my hourly entry you can clearly see this is a bearish engulfing pattern let me just zoom in a bit so that you can clearly see so we've got a bearish engulfing pattern being formed on an hourly chart right we would have noted that okay price action now is at a strong area of supply so now we have to hunt for short trades and hunting for short trades meaning we are hunting for bearish types of candlestick patterns in this case it came in as a bearish engulf so once i have i had seen uh, this uh, bearish engulfing this is where my entry point was that is on a 30 minute time frame and you can clearly see the result the end result so far is resulting in uh, so this is where the entry was currently we are floating on 21 pips but it went as far as 40 pips you see the trade so far has dropped a maximum of 40 pips yes some people would have closed already their positions there on 40 pips with a 0 0.1 lot size that's that's not a bad return for a day trade so you can clearly see 
I have my bullish engulfed here. Now look where my stop loss is. My stop loss is right above the last high. It's only 5 pips away, which is not bad, right? Because I was really expecting that level to hold. So this is a very good trade example illustrating a bearish engulfing candle. You can even see further on a 30 minute time frame. You can see why my entry was on the second candle. You can see this 30 minute candle engulfed one, two candles, right? They were all engulfed here. For some, this would have been a perfect entry to the downside. For those who are not aggressive with the market, this retracement here would have been a perfect entry to the downside because you'd have been basing that the, the sellers that came in at this price range here, they will hold price, which eventually happened, price dropped down to a new low and then retrace it again drop down and formed another new low so i'm really expecting price to drop all the way to this zone here or to this level here so this is what i wanted to illustrate i'll be doing more of these types of uh, trade examples so far i've done the bearish engulfing pattern and i've done an example on bullish engulfing pattern so as we go as the trades pan out i'll be showing you a real life trade example i wish you good luck and uh, happy trading thank you